Contact tracers have served as a crucial part of the COVID-19 pandemic. Now, in an effort to help contain the virus, NYIT.com will serve as contact tracers for the entire Arkansas state system. This comes as the fall semester of classes is set to begin on Monday. ARU had approached us in exploring the opportunity of what it would look like for us to support the contact tracing efforts. And so it started from there, and after several discussions, we were able to confirm that we had the capacity, the infrastructure to support the ASU system in contact tracing during this time. While contact tracing is through NYIT, they will hire tracers to perform the duties. The contact tracing will work out of the medical school on the A-State Jonesboro campus. They will also use the Delta Population Health Institute, a community engagement branch of NYIT. Dr. Lawrence says students, faculty and staff will have the opportunity to submit an electronic report and contact tracers will go to work. Whether they've been tested positive, whether they've been exposed, uh, to someone with COVID-19 or whether they have symptoms that they believe is related to COVID-19. And based on the submissions we receive, we will have case investigators reach out to those individuals and begin the contact tracing. It's a phone call confirming who they were around and making sure that we give them instructions around their health. We also talk about what they need to do to keep themselves and their family members and their community members safe. Dr. Lawrence says tracers will also provide medical resources to individuals in case their symptoms become worse. A-State will start their fall semester next week. NYIT plans to have the infrastructure put in place by the time students start class. Dr. Lawrence says they are currently looking to hire people from the community to serve as contact tracers. We're essentially looking for people who are able to communicate well and effectively with individuals, have experience primarily in, um, in customer service, and would help if they have experience in healthcare as well. We're going to be training them on what to say and what questions to ask, communicate with them so that we can provide them the information that they need. Now, if you are interested in becoming a contact tracer, applications can be found on the A-State website. They will be accepted on a rolling basis. For Northeast Arkansas News, I am Sarah Doan in Jonesboro.